What's up, everybody? We just uh, ordered 10.4. As you can see, we've uh, made a pretty good purchase. We haven't don't have every uh, computer in here yet. Um, so we have like 25 Emacs right here. These range from like what 2002 to 2005, I think. Mm -hmm. And then we have the IMAX. Uh, these are all graphite in here, um, but we have some ruby reds. We have a, an indigo and a couple of teals. Um, we have 15 that are working right now. We still got to figure out a couple more. Um, a couple of them are just straight trash. So we've been tearing them down and getting them working. Um, what else? We ordered a 10.4 so we can um, reset them all because these were school computers. So um, we need to go ahead and reset um, back to, uh, what is it, 10.4, which is uh, Tiger, I do believe. Uh, it's not too difficult. Um, this computer over here, this is a uh, eMac. We do believe it's a 2002. Uh, and it's uh, not, not awake right now. <laughs> um, but it's uh, 700 megahertz, you know, and they range from 700 megahertz all the way up to, uh, what is it, 1.26. 1.46 or something? Yeah, 1.46. over there. Yeah, somewhere. 1.42, I think. Yeah. Um, 1.24 is the fastest, and I think the slowest is 700. Right? Yeah, which yeah. is this one. Which is this one, but this is the most reliable one we found. It does have the uh, old-fashioned TV if you come in here close and take a listen. <laughs> Sounds pretty, like, hollow and springy. Uh, this is what one of the backs looks like over here. So that's what's inside of the... Uh, the uh, Emac, we gotta call it the uh, carbureted motor. <laughs> it's got it's a V2. It makes about 20 horsepower and it runs slower than a dog. So yeah, we're pretty uh, pretty excited with the purchase. Uh, we're gonna sell them most a couple of them, uh, probably f anywhere between 40 and 60 dollars. And uh, we figured out that we paid about two dollars per computer. So this is really a home run in our books. And we still have three. Three more pallets worth yeah. that we have to go and... Uh, this is only cover, two. So. And this one, um, most of them are marked with various um, problems or... Um, most of the ones on this side are needing to be reset. And then the ones over here further on have more and more issues until you get to completely Parts. crapped out. Parts, basically. Um, this one is our only uh, 1.25 that we've found so far, and uh, it has a bad hard drive on it. And unfortunately, hard drive and hard RAM is hard, to come by in this group. <laughs> hard drive and RAM is hard to come by. So what I've done over here this is I have a stick of RAM just sitting out That's... Um, to test computers that um, don't have it as we come along to it. And as you so... can see down here, we got plenty of spare parts. We got some extra covers. Um, yeah, that's all from the ones that are taken apart. Yeah, I got four of them. What was it? Four or five that we're just not going to be able to salvage whatsoever yeah. other than parts. So. I guess the previous owner tried to put them together and they were just... Too far gone. Yeah. Is a nice way of putting it. But we need the extra parts. So we have four that have given up some of their parts for sacrifice. So we'll be able to fix the rest of them. But um, anything else? Uh, no, uh, we'll bring out y'all another uh, update tomorrow, and we're going to try and do some more work. Like I said, I think we have uh, right around 15 or so that are working right now. Um, I know that this iMac here, unless we can get some parts off of that one over there, I doubt it will run again. Unless we see the issue. Actually, no, that one's running. Okay. The one's further on down. Yeah. There's four bad ones, unfortunately. This one just needs a cover and it's not booting. That one won't boot, that one won't boot. <laughs> that one won't boot. So we got four IMAX that we have plenty of parts we can take and put into the other ones. Like I said, we have two ruby red ones, which are probably the Still most, at the storage shed. Most difficult to ever ever find. So um, I'm pretty happy with the investment as long as we can get these out of here, you know, and turn them around before school. I think that we're going to make some pretty good money. And the rest of the good ones are in the office. Yeah, and even if we sell them for under market value, and these sell for about 60 bucks a piece, even though that they're pretty old, I mean, 
uh, we're gonna sell them for probably around 40, which is under market value, but it's gonna turn around quicker and we're gonna make better money so they're not just sitting here in the garage taking up space. So uh, I think that'll be around 15 and 40, so we'll be looking at over $400 uh, just for 15 computers, even though that four of them are trash. So <laughs> I'm, I'm smiling because we only made, you know, we only paid 200 bucks for the whole lot and we haven't even got the, the whole others, entire so, storage yeah. unit full. Pretty happy with it. Other than that, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Leave us a comment below so that way we can read what y'all are thinking of this new content. And remember to always stay motivated. Hulk them out.